So that was Ranger Baker. Yeah, Baker, Baker the Baker. Now, what was that song? Uh, uh, average white man, person to person. Yeah, man, average white man. Memories. They performed at, uh, I forgot where it was in Atlanta, but I did an interview with them on uh, at Magic, and that was the best interview. I was always in love with them, always in love with them. They were one of the first white groups. They got they they got automatic black passes from us because their music was amazing. And Steve Stephen Farone, he was the one. See that that's the stuff that you don't hear about these so-called music legends. Miss me with all of that. But Stephen Farone was the first one. Black the black drummer with Average White Band. He was the first one. The way that he it's kind of like the Isley Brothers, like, you know, that sounded like the Isley Brothers, some did did the fight the power thing. But no, but he was just, there was a beat how he did it. And he did that. He was the first to do, to play the drums that way. Stephen Furlong, find out about him, the black drummer and average white man. Shout out to him. Oh, I had a crush on them and they loved themselves some black women. <laughs> I'm smiling too much about that. I was never a groupie to anyone. I just loved the music. I was there for the music. I was there for the energy. And I was there for the actual love. You can actually love a group or hang with a group and not sleep with them. I am not like you. I'm not a groupie. I don't know where this got into with all the rappers and all the radio announcers and all the DJs felt like they got to sleep with each other. Where the fuck did that come from? I don't do that. But you going to make me do that? You going to get done up? <laughs> You ran into the right one, baby. Uh-huh. I am like my daddy. My daddy will fuck you up. My mom. I told you, both my parents packed the piece. There's a reason, well, there's a reason why I don't carry my Glock. Got real quiet. But that doesn't mean I'm not protected. Anyway, it's a gorgeous day. Person to person. There's so many people who have sampled off of average white band. Maybe they were sampling too. I don't know. That's, apparently that's what people do. They sample off of others. And yet you have the nerve to call yourself goats and you're supposed to set the industry. You're just a joke. I mean, what are y'all talking on? I don't need that smoking. Snoop Dogg, I'm sorry. What is this whole thing with Snoop Dogg and Martha? Well, you know, I guess they're both industry plants in their own way. Or they're just doing their thing. Okay, I have no beef with anybody today. But if you got beef with me, then you got a problem. Your problem is you. I'm saying you don't know me. I suggest you do you. Wow, it's the energy and the creativity that's coming through. What is this? I didn't used to do this stuff, honestly. Or maybe I did. But the doggy that came out here, a uh, lady with her dog came out here. This dog was something under here. Now, there's big old tadpoles. I think some of the frogs are starting to hide under here, deep, deep, deep under here, because maybe... The uh, Stillman can't get quite under here. But I'm just going to sit and chill. It's a beautiful day. The weather's really okay. It's a full moon, and I'm at play. I'm happy today. Are you? I'm not running. I mean, I don't have fake teeth, fake food, fake hair. I don't have make nothing. My boobs are real. My butt is real. My attitude is real. My love is real. My love is real. If I don't love you, it's you. And I don't want anybody that I had in the past. None of my past boyfriends, the other people who want to be my boyfriends. I don't know why people in my class, my high school class, trying to get up with me. Have your reunion. Do that. I did that. That was then. That was a long time ago for me. I don't really need to get up with anybody because you're not in my present. You're not going to be in my future. See, I'm not being funny. I just... It brings nothing to my new and future pot. Sometimes people just outgrow you. It's like... 
if you graduated from college or, or med school or something like that, do you, do you, okay, let me ask some of you. Now, some of you, you've got that one childhood friend, and I do. One. One. But that's it. I don't hang around the people I used to, you know, go to school with in the first, second, third grade or in high school or, or college. That was then, this is now. You grow up out of that, find your style. Why do people make it seem like, well, that person changed? Yeah, that's life, bitch. People change. <laughs> Plants change. Animals change. Flowers change. Flower comes, to, you know, starts out as a seed and it grows into a full blown flower. Same thing with a tree. But when people start to move ahead in their own frequency, they change. Yep. Yeah. I smell the water. I'm learning why. Um, the water quality too. Water quality, because we were talking about water quality. So, the water quality is, is good. Yeah. I want to learn about all of that. I'm a naturally trained. This is, this is good for me. Because you will always be able to learn something from nature. Nature is, nature really is the never ending story. Nature is always evolving. Animals get it. Humankind just don't so much. Planets be changing too. The earth be changing too right up from under you. Somebody is fooling you on YouTube. I don't know why. I don't know who owns Russia or China or whatever it is. My crew, we're not into this politics shit. <laughs> What's to talk about? I mean, we're not. It's no, it's no longer feasible to talk about common sense. Because y'all don't want it. Y'all don't, you don't want, you don't want common sense. You want entertainment. You know what? Edutainment. They never had Karis one since you were the first one to say that word. You bitches in Atlanta, and I call you what you are. You bitches, and I and I hear I hear a particular which 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 bitch got a problem with me. I heard you from which bitch anywhere got a problem with me, but you won't get up in my face, but you want to hide behind keyboards and send your goons on the way. What's a goon to a goblin, they say? Did she go tapping again? Okay. Wow, Lecrae. I still can't, you know, the spread the ops out. Spread the ops out. The minute that I heard you say Will Smith, and I went, there it is. God damn it. Nigga. When you spend that all that time, I don't care. And Jada and all of them, you going to sue me? What you going to do? What you please, please, please get Italian lawyers, Jewish lawyers, stand by. I only want the best, okay? We going to make money. Please try. Please try. Please try to sue me. Don't let me get, I, you know what? Let, pull the lie detector test out. Let's go. Let's go go let's go that's a real reality show but i don't think you can go i don't know you don't know i don't care i really don't care this is the thing one thing about libra so i do know that libras always want the attention on them always i'm a libra moon my husband was a libra so in the when i was working and stuff like that and i'm in my zone and reminding you this is when the alcoholism was getting to him and he would do this stuff called he would take like you know the, the military gift from like i don't know it was a tranquilizers or something they would they just shoot these soldiers up full of pills that one thing about it, my husband wasn't really that big of a pill popper. Luckily, because of me, we were into the more natural way of living because I honestly wanted to help him naturally. Because, I mean, I'm, nurse, I'm a nurse's kid, and I knew some of those pills, like, you need to look at this stuff. And he, and he listened to me. So that was the beautiful thing about him. That was my true soulmate. But, you know, his, his, his family, that generational curse, man, that... That's what ate him. Oh, God. I, 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 mm-mm. Ah, -mm. oh, man. You never get over it. You just get through it day to day. I still have a PTSD that just can kind of come out, you know, in some ways. And then I have to bring myself back. I heard the, like I felt the wind. Mommy felt, I felt the breeze in the trees, like, I felt the woo-woo. I did. Thank you. Therapy. Heard. Heard. Oh, wow. The reflection.
There we go. There you go, girl. There you go. Isn't that beautiful? <sighs> there goes the bird. Mommy felt it. Mommy felt it. Because it's so. Uh, Yeah, but um, funny but not funny. But when he was like, you know, popping some of that, you know, medicine that they were giving him at Fort Bragg, you know, and and then with Cisco. And if you all know what that drink Cisco is, did I hear these young people want to try Cisco? You youngins can't even handle weed right, real weed. You're not about that life. Was it Cisco or was it Mad? No, it was Mad Dog. Is that on, on TikTok? That they're, you know, you got all these young people. You know what? This generation is in trouble. The parents didn't raise them right. The godparents didn't raise them right. The schools didn't raise them right. Their peers ain't raising nobody but hell. And then, you know, you got the little incel crew. You got the little Hollywood crew. And they're more 